Greetings, my name is Natasha Rachel and this is my application to become a Google Certified Trainer. You know Reed Drummond on the Food Network known as the Pioneer Woman? At the beginning of her show she always says welcome to my frontier. Well welcome to my frontier in Atlanta Public Schools in the Department of Instructional Technology. Oh, Miss Brown, I wonder what she wants. Hello? Oh, Miss Brown, how are you? Oh no, I was just looking through Facebook. They did what? They plagiarized again? Are you serious? I have just the tool for you. I'll be at your school tomorrow at 8 o'clock to show you. I got your back, girl. All right, bye. My name is Natasha Rachel, and I'll be showcasing a tool for my Google for Education Certified Trainer Program application. The tool that I'll be showcasing, of course, can be located in my drive. So what I'm going to do is click on New from my Google Drive, and I'm going to, going to click on Google Docs. The tool that I am going to be showcasing I just recently discovered, and I'm going to be showing you how you can cite sources in Google Docs with the click of a button. So this is great to show our students that are as they're writing research reports in Google Docs and they need to cite their online resources. Um, this is a great feature, like I said, that I just discovered and it will insert citations um, as footnotes into our paper. So we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to go ahead and title our paper. Um, and then let's say that I've written this whole great essay about traumatic brain injury. Awesome sauce. I'm going to come down here to this little cute explore button down here on the bottom right hand side. And so because I've already done a search on this, it um, automatically comes up for us already. But um, you can go ahead and type in your search box here what you are searching for. So traumatic brain injury. And then we get all of these awesome resources that open up that we can search um, the web, images, or different resources that are already um, in our Google Drive. So let's go back to the web version and let's say that we like this resource here, Traumatic Brain Injury. We're gonna get a great article that opens up. So we go through it, we find exactly what we're looking for, we pull some information out of there, and of course we need to cite it. So what I wanna do first is click on these three dots here, the snowman, and make sure for me that this is in APA format but you do have the option of MLA, APA, and Chicago. So we're gonna go with APA. Again, this is the article that I wanna cite here. So I'm gonna click on these little awesome quotations here, and it's gonna put the indicator here. And as I scroll to the bottom of my page, guess what? There's my citation, my awesome footnote, automatically with a simple click of a button. So now our students have no excuses not to cite their work. Hope you enjoyed this quick little video. Thank you so much.